It's been decades in the making. The city of Omaha announcing a $500 million plan that is expected to bring back life to Crossroads Mall at 72nd and Dodge. Reporter Kent Lutzen was at today's big announcement and he joins us live with more. Kent? Thanks, Ruta. Coming this October, the city of Omaha, along with two developers, will be demolishing the Crossroads Mall, along with most of the buildings on this 40-acre site. Now, the only two buildings that are safe are Target and the parking garage behind it. Now, replacing this dead zone is going to be a variety of different spaces. Lockwood Development and Century Development want to build retail restaurants, a hotel, office space, apartments, and family fun zones like bowling alleys or laser tag. The developers say their goal is for the shops to blend in with its environment, creating an experience for everyone here in Omaha. The price tag, $500 million. Mayor Gene Stothard says the city will use $12.5 million of redevelopment bonds to help pay for infrastructure costs in and around the Crossroads development. The redevelopment bonds are very specific with their use and they cannot be used to supplement the general fund, which is where we have our shortfall right now. Lockwood uh, plans to apply for tax increment financing and also enhanced employment area financing. There are still a lot of details that need city approval and plans are sure to change. As for potential tenants, they are not ready to announce those names yet. Now, they are ready to break a ground again in October with a finished product expected in 2024. Now, we heard from area residents along with we'll have more details and we'll have that full report coming up tonight at 10. Reporting in Omaha, Kent Lutzen, 3 News Now. Back to you, Ruta.